What's poppin' YouTube? It's your boy J Purple. Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a minute. I've just been off of YouTube for for a good while. Not not like a good while. Probably for like a couple weeks, man. Like shit. How y'all doing, man? I'm I always do this. I'm sorry. Like I'll be grinding and then like I'll fall back. I, I gotta stop doing that. That's unhealthy. I, I can't. I gotta keep on being consistent if I want to do this. Last time I spoke to y'all, I had a I had an injury that was caused by a hit and run, so yeah, I was out for a while, but you know, I'm all better now, and I just want to show you the results, it's almost healing, it's, well, most of it is healed, but it still has more healing to do, but I didn't really get to show y'all a picture of what it looked like before, so if y'all have like a weak stomach, just skip a few seconds forward, but if not, then here's what it looked like two weeks ago. I see how nasty that shit look. Imagine having to like sleep, bro. That shit is painful. I had to sleep on this side of my arm and have my arm just like lay on a pillow. That shit hurt. <laughs> that shit hurt a lot. I wanted to talk to y'all today because I wanted to like talk about how this incident really changed my life for for the better you know the reason why is because all my life i've just been all talk saying i want to do this i want to do that but never done it and it's not that i didn't want to do it it's just that i didn't have that energy to i just been lazy that incident happened you know it really like put me in shock because I thought my life was really over. It really changed my life because now I'm, you know, taking a big step forward in my life. I'm very unhappy because of me shutting down my own dreams. And one of my dreams has one of my dreams that I've always wanted to accomplish. I've always wanted wanted to be a wrestler. Always wanted to be a pro wrestler. That was my thing. Growing up, I love WWE. That's always been my thing. Just to win championships, win the Royal Rumble, Money in the Bank ladder match, all that. I've always wanted to do those things when I was younger, but I shut them down because a lot of people had negative opinions on it. So, you know, all I got was negativity and it caused me to not pursue that dream anymore. But when I got older, I started to realize how you know, you only live once, and if you don't do the things that you love doing, you're not going to be happy. And good thing I have um one of my closest friends, Khalil. Khalil, if you've seen this, I love you, bro. Um, Yeah, he really sparked my interest in wrestling again, because I never really had friends who were into wrestling as much as I was. He's literally the only person, you feel me? And a few others that I met in college. But... Yeah, that really, that really wanted me to, you know, pursue that dream. That accident, it, it really, like, woke me up and was like, you almost died. Go do what you love doing. Fuck what everybody else say. You feel me? So that's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to take this shit seriously. The school that I had showed up to is called World Wrestling Extreme. Y'all should go check their Instagram out. I'm going to put it right here. I'm going to be attending that wrestling program in the future. Just wait. Just wait. I'm just trying to get my money up, you feel me? But it's going to happen. Your boy Jay Purple going to be a wrestler, I promise you. I'm really excited because this is the first time I'm taking control over my future. Because I used to just talk about it. And now I'm taking control. I'm going to the gym every morning, bro. Not every morning. I Saturday, Sunday, I have a break. But Monday through Friday, I would try to wake up at 5 in the morning. And go to the gym and just work out. And I honestly felt better, you know, because every time I wake up early, it's more life. You know, you get to experience more hours of your life. Instead of just waking up at like 11 and 12, you only got like, what, 12 hours left? Or even less. I'd rather just wake up early and experience all the hours that God gave me. Don't worry, your boy hasn't changed. I'm still the goofy ass nigga as always, you feel me? I haven't been making skits. It's been a while. But I'm probably going to come up with some stuff. You know, I think I just got to, like, 
I just gotta I just gotta keep on doing it, even though when I don't feel like doing it. But hey, it's whatever. But yeah, this I just I just wanted to let y'all know how I'm how I'm doing, you feel me? And you know, I'm taking, you know, steps in my life to become better. Because I really want this for myself because if I die, I'm not gonna be able to do it and that's just gonna be a waste. You know? So yeah, I just I just have to do this. I really do. And one thing about, you know, wrestling, the fact that I've always wanted to do YouTube and wrestling, I didn't really think I could do both, but I think I can. I know other wrestlers do it, so I'm going to do it. But yeah, once I, once I first joined that school, I'm going to be making content, y'all, and I'm going to show y'all my wrestling skills, you feel me? <laughs> yeah. But, um, yeah, anyway, that's, that's it. I'm gonna come back with some more videos, hopefully. Um, but, yeah, I made a speedy recovery. I'm 100% fine, but not 100% healed. You feel me? But, yeah, I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Make sure you like, subscribe, share with your friends. You already know the vibes. Peace.